Hi, my name is Manuel Espinoza, professor of mathematics, and in this video we will learn about solving real-world problems about exponential growth and decay. The exponential function is a function in the form a times b raised to the x power, where a and b are factors, and b is the exponential factor. Neither a nor b could be equals to zero, and b cannot be equals to one. If b is greater than 1, it is an exponential growth function. If b less than 1, it is exponential decay. In real-world problems, factor a is the initial value, r is the rate in decimal, and t is the time. The sum of 1 and r is equivalent to the factor b. Why is the final value? In the exponential decay, the difference of 1 in the rate is equivalent to the exponential factor b. In the following example, $196,000 is the initial value a in 2015. The rate is 4% divided by 100% or 0.04. The time is 10 years. The house appreciated through the years, then we use the exponential growth formula. The final output y equals the initial value, a times the sum of 1, and the rate raised to the t time. Substituting. Simplifying. The house will worth $290,080 in the year 2025. In the following checkpoint the house initial worth $110,000 in 2021 and appreciate at a rate of 6% per year. This is a rate of 0 0.06. What will be the value in 2026?
The Green's house will worth $147,400 in 2026. This example is about the price of a tractor that decreases through the years. This is exponential decay. Initial price of $45,000. Decrease rate of 0.12 for 5 years. The equation for the exponential decay is final output y equals the initial value a times the difference of 1 and the rate raised to the time. Substituting accordingly. Now we will use this formula to calculate the value of the tractor after 5 years. Substitute the time by 5. Simplify the equation by using order of operations. The value of the tractor after 5 years will be $23,850. Checkpoint 2 is similar to the example 2. The initial value of the car is $32,000 depreciates at a rate of 0.12 each year for 4 years and 0.08 each year thereafter. We would like to know the car value in 6 years. This problem consists on two parts, 
the value of the car after four years at a depreciation rate of 0.12 and two years later at 0.08. At the beginning of the first four years, the cost was $32,000. Rate of 0.12. The final value or output of the first four years, $19,190.25, will be the initial value or input for the next two years. After a total of six years, the value of the car will be $16,242.63. I hope this video helped you with the study of the application of exponential growth and decay. Thank you.